I remember growing up and driving out on the beach and there being a bluefish blitz and everybody's just chucking the fish on the beach and you go home and you fry them up and you eat them and I mean there's there's no better food than that. We don't have to encourage people to like the coast. People like the coast. Look at all of the people around us. What they need to know is how are they impacting the coast. I have a nine-year-old and a, a five-year-old. I began to think about what are we leaving to them. And I think all of us as North Carolinians benefit from the efforts of the North Carolina Sea Grant. Sea Grant to me is anytime I have a question or have a problem, they have the answer. <laughs> North Carolina Sea Grant is a really uh, vibrant program. That funds coastal and marine science research to address real world problems. What Sea Grant likes to do is look for win-win situations. North Carolina Sea Grant certainly plays a role in bridging science to action. Not the gee whiz science, it's the how do we fix this science. Sea Grant is definitely hands-on. It's more like an agricultural extension service and the time till understanding and application is very short. North Carolina Sea Grant has a history of being very accessible. They helped me get started on shedding crabs. That helped all the people that crab. As far as aquaculture, the state is one of the most diverse in the U.S. We have a great potential here on the coast. I've known since I was in the, I don't know, junior high that I wanted to work with the ocean. I work with the fishing industry, both recreational and commercial, as well as fishery scientists and managers. Um, one of the main things I do is I work with teachers and informal educators. I want to get them excited about what, what the ocean does, what it means to us. For over 38 years, we've worked on rip current safety. Sea Grant has, has helped NOAA and U.S. Life Saving Association uh, in developing the materials for these rip current warning signs. When you give free advice for a career, you don't get a whole lot of feedback. But one of the things we have gotten back is a thank you letter from a swimmer that got caught in a rip current and said, thank you for saving my life. You know, they just have this network of people and you know resources that they can reach out to and try and figure out ways to help. The more physical development we have, the less of that natural beauty that we have. But that's where Sea Grant can have a great impact. They can provide you the knowledge. If the knowledge doesn't exist, they can actually do the research that's necessary to give you the answer that you want. I want people to know about North Carolina Sea Grant because I think it's an awesome program that our state has had for 50 years. And they have the resources and the staff that help things come to fruition. Sea Grant is very unique in that we have a lot of different specialties. Sea Grant is a go-to place.